In this video, we are going to create an orchestration that uses a connector request and a form request. In this video, if you want to advance to the other sections of this video, hover over the left side of the screen and you will see the chapters available to jump to. Now this is a continuation of our discussion on using a connector request, which also demonstrated setting up a connection. The use of a connector request requires a soft-coded connection, as it is called, to get access to a third party or other types of systems. But in the case of this example that we are going to use, this connector can be considered just one part of the process. So now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to navigate back over to the Orchestrator Studio. So at this point, I'm inside the Orchestrator Studio. I'm going to click on my form request and we're going to see the form request that we just created, which we see here. On this page, we're going to go ahead and select the Revise Currency Exchange Rates uh, tab here. And this is going to show us all of the fields that have been returned. And here we see all of our inputs here. We're going to do a little cleanup here. So these are the things that are going to appear when we actually do the run the orchestration. So I'm going to just make this a little um, easier to understand. And so we're going to make this our from currency. And then we're going to go down here and and we will select that. So these are the three things that we want to have part of our transformations. Once we have that, we'll go ahead and click on save again. Now everything should be lined up to run for our orchestration.